Hello, my beautiful Aries. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys for the like, share, comments, as well as subscribe. Let's get your messages. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for Aries, Spirit Guys, Angels, Guys, Ancestors, Universe. Okay, I feel like I said the same thing, but you get what I'm saying? Spirit Guys, what messages do you have for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Only take messages that resonate with you, okay? So we have separation. So someone is going through a separation, a breakup, time apart from your per from your partner is on the horizon very soon. So very soon, is <coughs> whoa, <coughs> excuse me. Very soon, a separation will be coming to an end. Okay, because someone could have clearly decided what they want. Okay, because it's in reverse. If it was in the upright, it's like not knowing, not deciding not taking action okay all up in your head confused all right so somebody could be coming out of illusions okay let's see let's get one most this one wants to make the effort we have deception and calling in your soulmate heart to heart so someone could have been wearing a mask towards you it could be a past life soulmate or it could be a soulmate that you're in uh interacting with now reconciliation and chemistry so this person definitely was wearing a mask towards you, but they steady still manifest you and call in your energy. You and this person could be in separation, okay, but this person very soon is knowing what it is that they want. They could be letting go and control issues, or you are, okay? Give me one more spirit. We have finances and career and codependency. So someone could have been in a codependent relationship or connection with someone that was just using them for finances, okay? Every take it where it resonates. Okay, so that's why they was deceiving you, lying to you, stringing you along, playing you. Okay, this you could know about this person being with someone, or you didn't know. Okay, take it where it resonates. Then we had calling in your soulmate. So you and this person could both be manifesting each other or calling each other in. Okay, whoever this person is, you're in separation from. But this person is wanting to come out of separation. All right. But it could be something going on with this person's finances, okay? Due to codependency. Okay, so be mindful of someone trying to come towards you and just use you for your finances or to use your energy to get finances, okay? Because there's some deception in the mix in uh, between this situation, okay? But in the middle, we have calling in your soulmate. So, yeah, just be mindful of that, okay? So, let's see what's going on. Seven of Wands, yeah, protect yourself, protect your energy, okay? Someone could be blocked. Someone could be getting blocked, okay? What's the Seven of Wands? Ace of Caps, Nine of Caps, Nine of Pentacles, okay? <sighs> Someone heart chakra could be blocked. Okay. We got two nines here. So nine, nine, nine could be significant. Okay. Someone is definitely focused on their self. Okay. Or somebody could be plotting and planning to see how they can take somebody for everything. I don't freaking know what this is. What's this nine to cut? Get the hair from. The Knight of Wands. What's this Knight of Wands? The World Cup. Hmm. So you could have cut... <laughs> I don't know why I just heard that. So you could have cut off connection from this person from the 5D with the World Cup. It could have been a lot of um, 5D interactions with you and this person. With the Herifa, the World, and the Knight of Wands. What's this Ace of Cups? You just could be closed off. You had three of swords. You feel like this person 
could have... Okay, let me slow down. So this person could have been a player, right? With the Knight of Wands. You could have felt like this person lied to you with the Three of Swords. Because when you offered your cup, this person could have blocked you out. Seven of Wands. Or it could be vice versa. Someone could have been filling themselves with this Nine of Cups and Nine of Pentacles. So they probably felt as though making you jealous with a third party or with other people was going to make you feel some kind of way. But all it did was just made you like end it with the world card. What's this three of swords? That's why I said it's some deception here. Yeah, four of pentacles. This person held back from you and tried to make you jealous by playing around with you. Or probably could have been gaslighting you or love bombing you. Thinking that it was by them being the knight of wands, there's other people out here better. Or that can fit your image or that can, um, what is it? Be, um, a, a a copy of you is what I'm getting. It's like someone trying their best to be you or to have your identity. Nine of Pentacles. What is this? What is give me more of this three of swords? Yeah, ten of swords. It was a bad outcome. And wind up getting betrayed. So all this jealousy this person was trying to do because of someone else, they wind up getting betrayed by this person and played by this person. Because <clears throat> all this person wanted them for was for whatever they had with the Nine of Cups. With this Four of Pentacles. Yeah, Ace of Swords, Queen of Cups. This person held back from you. But they see, they know who you are. They know the truth about you. Let's see, who, what's the Queen of Cups? Yeah, the three of wands. Someone that they're in separation from. You could be an air sign or you could be a water sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You could be either one of those signs. And this person is in separation from you. Okay? But they held back from you. Lied to you with the three of swords. Just so they can play around with other people. With other options. And all them options ended up to be the tennis swords. <clears throat> but they know now with the ace of swords, the queen of caps, and the three of wands. What's this ace of swords? Yeah, four of wands. I'm telling you, this person knows the truth. They know who they want to reunite with. They know who they want to be with. They know who they want to settle down with. They know who they want to be committed to. This person know with the Ace of Swords. Yeah, the Sun card, I'm telling you. This person just wanted to... Want, I guess wanted you to fall for their tactics or play along with their games. Yeah, because this person know you walked away from the connection. Okay? This person could have probably wanted to make you friends with benefits or something like that. And you was like, uh, no, sir. An empress? Because you can have anybody that you want. Nine of Pentacles and a Nine of Cups, like literally. Okay, you're so sufficient, independent, you're successful. You take care of yourself, you smell good, you look good. Okay? Male or female, you're just a beautiful person inside and out. And you have a lot of love to give and a lot of respect. A lot of people respect you. Come to you for advice, look up to you. A lot of people listen to you. And you know how to protect yourself from people, places, and things that you know that's no longer serving you. The seven to one. I guess this person thought that they could spiritually play you. Yeah, and who is it? It's Divine Masculine. This Masculine thought that they could spiritually play you. But look, you was already two steps ahead of this Masculine. This Masculine didn't like the fact that you can see right through the... <laughs> This master don't like the fact you can see right through them. Like, all these little tactics that this person was trying to do to make you jealous, put you in competition with other people, okay? Try to make it feel like, make you feel like or make it seem like that you're not, they're not interested in you or attracted to you. 
Like unnecessary betrayal and pettiness for what? Trying to play you, they done played they self when this person already knew. The person that they was at a distance from with the three of wands, who was this queen of cups, ace of swords, is their twin. It's their union. It's their divine counterpart. This person, though, it's nothing about them slow. They might play like they don't know, but they know. This person did was delaying things. Okay? This person don't like the fact you can literally see right through them. Or that you always right. Yeah, King of Swords. Nine of Wands. This person could be wounded. This King of Swords. This person is wounded. They're in a, in in some form of regret with this. Yeah, deep regret. The Moon and the Five of Cups. And they could want to come in and offer you something. Now with the Page of Pentacles, yeah, the Fool. Take action, King of Wands. Open up to you and communicate. So this could be like a potential connection. Maybe this person didn't see it at first. Because they didn't take it seriously. Okay? Yeah, because Seven of Swords, this person still wanted to do what they do. Be sneaky. Play tricks. Play games. Trying to finesse people. Okay? Because this person was coming from a very hurt and wounded space as well. So this person could have real bad trust issues. So every chance or opportunity somebody, every time this person got close to somebody or this person started to feel emotions and feelings, because this Ace of Cups is out here, this person ran. They started doing shady shit. Shady aftermath. 12, 12 on the clock. Okay. This person started doing some shady shit. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I said this person was playing spiritual games. Like, this person was I'm a spiritual asshole. Yeah, the food card. Now they want to take a risk, take a leap of faith, ace the ones, and start a passion and begin hoping that y'all can heal together with the four fools. Hash out through a conversation. This person is going to apologize, Knight of Cups. Okay? When they hash out whatever differences, or uh, I don't know, I heard misinterpretations. <laughs> so this person be like, You're misinterpreting shit. <laughs> six of swords, six of wands, king of cups. This person is like. This person could put you up on a high pedestal. But it's like them wanting to take the lead and take action towards you. They slow down. Six of Swords. King and Queen of Cups. King and Queen of Swords. This person knows you see right through them. Okay, this person knows what's going on. What's the Six of Swords in reverse? Yeah, the Ten of Wands. This person felt seemed like it's too hard for them to like make a move towards you right now. It's 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 a it's a struggle. It's a burden. It's a hassle, I heard. What's this ten of wands? Page of Pentacles. What's this page of Pentacles? The eight of wands. This person needs to just communicate. They need to open up and communicate. Give me one this Queen of Swords, the Emperor, and the Will of Fortune. I'm telling you, Ace of Pentacles, Five of Cups. This person feels bad because they didn't offer you the, this Ace of Pentacles. We got the Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, and the Ace of Swords. This is definitely a new love right here. Or someone that you could already know or already be connected to. This person feels sad. They feel lonely. They feel bad. Five of Cups. They're in regret. And remorse, crying over spilled milk. Wanting to travel towards you and bring in 
and close in this gap between y'all because this person know and understand and see clarity and truth that you are their four ones. We got the emperor and the empress out here. Yeah, five of wands, competition, internal conflict. What's this ace of pentacles? The queen of pentacles. Yeah, this person wanted to... This person could have been settling as well because of something from their past or whatever the case may be because codependency is out here. So this person was settling, but they see you as someone that they can... build with what's this queen of pentacles get yeah, a five of pentacles some okay if this person is still in the merge right because the hurricane is out here That's why I heard at the beginning somebody could be getting taken for everything that they have. Five of Pentacles. What's this five of Pentacles? Two of Cups. They left you out to reconnect with somebody else or something else. This person might then believe in this connection or believe in this spiritual connection at first. I'm hearing that this person got hit with some harsh truths or some ugly truths. So that's why this person was defensive and blocked off towards you and was holding back four of pentacles. We got the two of cups and the four of wands. This is definitely a twin flame, divine mass and the divine feminine. But this person left you out and abandoned you. Okay. You had to find a stable, common ground to get back into yourself or get back to your senses. You had to do a lot of nurturing. Okay, you had to go back and heal some more triggers that this person could have brought out of you that you thought that you already done healed. Because this person wanted to play. Knight of Wands. Yeah, they juggled you and deceived you. This person was wearing a mask. That's the deception with somebody from their past. Okay, we already know that. Yeah, the tower. Yeah, now this King of Pentacles is wanting a second chance. They're wanting to apologize and make up for lost time. This person is praying, wishing, and hoping that y'all can make amends, reconcile, reconnect. Because the Empress is right here with this King of Pentacles. And you are this Queen of Pentacles. Who they chose not to get an offer to. So they left you all in your feelings and emotions with the Five of Cups. But all it did was backfire with the time. Ooh, what's this five of cups? Yep, eight of pentacles. This person feels bad that they didn't even at least try to fix or work on it. Work on y'all friendship. Even if y'all be friends. Okay? This person is probably not going to admit the fact that they need you and that they want you. Nine of Cups and the Five of Pentacles. Okay? This person might not say it. Because this person is like, they hold a lot in. They hold a lot back. 
Okay, this person don't say too much. It's like a mystery with this person. Like this person gonna always keep you guessing, but when they tell you what it is and they come to you and they be straightforward with the King of Swords, they let it be known. Though. Okay, respectfully. I can't say that. This person just be blocking a lot of stuff out or blocking a lot of stuff off. What's this King of Swords? Yeah, the Three of Pentacles. This person feel like y'all have a lot of common. That y'all will understand each other very well. Because you just see right through this person. Okay. I thought I seen the page of Swords out here. You and this person could have met at work. Or somewhere in a work setting. Okay, where it's always busy. Eight of Pentacles. Okay. We have we have Indigo on by Chris Brown. So you're definitely helping this person ascend and spiritually awaken. I'm dreaming. What's this three of Pentacles? Eight of Cups. So this person is walking away from third parties or anything that's distracting them because they can't stop watching you. They're always watching you. Yep. Look, we got temperance, this king of wands, the uh, death card. This person is watching you in the dark night of the soul. Okay. But they have a lot of guides around them. So this person is going through a spiritual awakening. Another one. Or you could have triggered something in this person. Which is the real ones. Because it's like this person can't find their way around it. It's like, ain't no way around. 22, 22. I don't know why I'm hearing that future song. I'm about to catch a body here, baby. We got immature man. Yeah, this person was trying to come towards you immaturely with this night of wands. Okay. Thinking that you was one of them. They just want somebody to just be having sex and that's it, that's all. You said what? I'ma need you to grow up. Once you grow up again in this emperor energy, then we can talk. Look, for real. You said once once you get in this emperor energy, then we can talk. We can get some weed. Okay? See what you talking about. You can't come to me and be wounded. Okay? Not like that, but I'm just saying. Because this person going to come to you wounded, though, when they talk to you. When y'all have a face-to-face -face conversation. Because the Ace of Swords out here, so some truth and clarity is coming your way. I need some space. This person needed some space. We got forced love is not love, but it's in reverse. So this person feels as though this love is not forced. Okay? Stop writing checks you can't cash. It took for you to block this person out, to dismiss this person, to ignore this person, to continue to love, nurture and focus on you and seek clarity and truth for you in order to stay stable in order to move forward and put it in the past put this person in the past or leave it all behind you for this person to want to communicate and talk to you now all of a sudden because the eight of wands is out here you had to really walk away from this person completely with the world call yeah let me see your truth the real you this person thought that they was going to keep you strung alone as a rebound or one night stand or somebody on the sideline, why they get this chaotic ass shit they got going on dealing with this codependent relationship? Yeah, wake up call. This person is going through a major wake up call. Respect is earned, it's not giving. Yeah, you just like, what? You gotta respect me. You came out with the Ace of Swords and the Queen of Cups. Like, what? I told you this person is coming in towards you wounded. I feel wounded. 
Oh, baby. I don't know what this person thought. They must have thought that they could finesse you. And they thought that they was going to try to finesse you spiritually, though, with the hair font. Like, they was going to use spirituality to finesse you or something. Or trick you. I don't know what this person thought. Okay? But Spirit say, no, sir. Ten of swords in the world. It's over. Look, I can't stop thinking about you. I'm telling you, now this person wants this connection. Do you want this connection or not? As I said, this person... They didn't know what they want. That's why very soon in reverse, we'll say clearly decide what it is that you want. So we're going to come towards you. Come to you now. This person now want to ask, do you want this connection or not? Let's play. This person, I said this play. This person played too many games. Too many. What else is left that needs to be said? Yeah, you're just like, okay. Just hear this person out. Sometimes I feel worthless. That's that five of pentacles. This person trying to make you feel like you wasn't worthy for them. Or you wasn't worthy enough. It wasn't love at first sight for me. That's what I'm saying. This person was wearing a mask. They was lying about their whole feelings and emotions when they knew what their feelings and emotions were. This person just wanted to string you along, have you as a rebound, a sideline, or whatever the case may be. Quarterback, runner up, put, put. Sorry, no. <laughs> yeah, we got mature woman. That's what I say. You can't put a mature woman in that situation. You have been the biggest life, biggest lesson of my life in this fa dysfunctional family issue. People cheat all the time. This is the second time I didn't seen that car, but I didn't take the first one out. So whoever they're with, they just be cheating on each other. It just be a whole bunch of one side in this going on over there. I don't know. What's up with that? Like, they just be recycling the same issues that they still need to learn from. Yeah. When this person is with that person, they're very immature. So, because that person act immature with that person, this person feels as though they can be immature towards you and play you. But you are this mature woman. You're in this king, this queen of pentacles energy. Very mature, very stable, very grounded. Okay, you don't have time to be playing around with these little kids, these little boys. You told this man, look, boss up or get lost, okay? Because you're like, I can see right through you. But when they with you or they around you, this person, I don't know. They might open up a little bit, but they still got some immature insecurity ways. And it's because they was dealing with that person that they codependent with. Because that person that they codependent that's codependent on them or that they're codependent on is just taking this whole person's masculinity. Masculinity or manhood. I can't even get it out, y'all. I just sound the country shit, 28, 28. But yeah, this is your message, Aries. Like, share, comment, as well as subscribe. And hit that bell notification. Peace.